This is my first impression of Redfall's gameplay. Arcane Studios' latest game and it's being published by Bethesda. We're going to go through the starting characters quickly here and then we're going to jump into the game so I can show you guys what the gameplay is actually like. You have to unlock the hardest difficulty so we're going to be playing on midnight for now just to make this as hard as possible. And these are the starting four characters in the game. Each one of them has different skills and abilities which we're going to quickly go over starting out with Remy who can make a rally point that heals her allies. She has a healing ability. She has an area of effect healing ability, a robot that can be used to distract enemies, and also a C4 charge which can be thrown at enemies or even attached to your robot and blown up. Then we have Devinder, who is a lot more exciting to me as a character. He is the black light contraption which releases UV light once deployed and that freezes any vampire foes that are near you. Or Translocate, which is basically a deployable teleporter that he throws and then you can teleport yourself to it, which is massively useful for getting around the map. He also has the Arc Javelin which is an area of effect stun which zaps nearby humans or vampires. Next up we have Layla. Call in a favor from your ex-boyfriend Jason who happens to be a vampire. So you essentially just get a melee vampire on your own team who decimates other enemies and also acts as a massive distraction. She also has the Umbrella ability which is just a wall that stops projectiles from enemies hitting you and then you can find it forward dealing damage to enemies. All these skills by the way can also be upgraded. The lift ability which really helps you getting around the map. You and your teammates basically use it to launch off like a jump pad. And then finally we have Jacob which we're going to be playing today. His ultimate is the heart stopper. Basically you summon a sniper with aimbot so you automatically lock onto enemies heads and just keep pressing the trigger to destroy all of them. It's cloak ability which lets you turn completely invisible hiding from all enemies and then the raven ability which tags all the enemies in the location for you so you know exactly where they are which helps you take them out stealthily so let's go ahead and begin what happened in redfall is my fault i think it used to be a nice town when i first got here i thought i could help they said one drop of my blood could change everything Free people from sickness, maybe from death. A world where nobody was left out. Cups overflowing, rivers of living water. I was a fool. They were monsters. They took more than a drop. They took everything. <laughs> She got harvested. Now, something evil is swallowing up this place bit by bit. When the people here realized what was going on, it was already too late. Folks are at each other's throats, begging the monsters to spare them. Some are just hiding, scared, waiting for a rescue that ain't coming. Some tried to get away. But the monsters who started all this weren't having it. There's nowhere to go. Nobody ever believes things can get this bad. Until it happens. Then, it's too late. There are people who can fight back. I think they can save this place. I mean, we tried to run away. There's just one thing standing in their way. A whole town full of vampires. Man, I hope this is dark and gritty. Oh, mate, he's feasting. Oh, 
Oh yeah, get some of that. We need more vampire games. Here's some long ass limbs, right? Okay. <laughs> we jump scared her. Walk away from me. No one can. You all belong to us. The others want you dead. But I want you here. Alive. I can use you. Yo. I was the sun. You will never see the sun again. The sun's right there, though. She lied. She was wrong. Mate, we need to get out of here. I think I'm on the boat that from the intro. Damn. Gotta get out of this tin can while there's still daylight. Should have known those things wouldn't let us get away. Uh, oh, oh, oh. oh, is that my raven? I have like a pet raven on this character. Dude, this must be the ocean and whatever the vampires did to stop us from leaving. Redfall is essentially like a small island town. It's 2023. Oh no! Is this gonna happen? The Captain's Journal. This is my last passage. I won't be returning to Redfall in my nearly 30 years of captaining this ferry. I've never seen anything as horrible or as despicable as what I've seen over the last few weeks. I've seen good, kind people attack innocent folks minding their own business. Creatures out of bad dreams biting into people begging for it. Oh, so people want to become vampires. I've heard a terrible voice playing through my TV. Missing children and pet posters are piling up. Lunatics wearing ski masks, breaking into houses and pulling families out. The list goes on and I wish it didn't. But it's time to save whatever's left. I need to get these scared, exhausted people out of here for good. Oh, so that, that failed. That did not go well. Oh boy, it did not go well. I, I hope that this game has, like, lots of these cool little lore and... stock up on medical supplies. No telling what else is out here. Lots of lore and story bits as we go. In case of emergency, Tess, if things go wrong or we get separated on the ferry, here's what you need to do. Go to the car, grab the gun and ammo. Yes, I have a gun and I'm sorry I didn't tell you. Okay, is the car downstairs then? Okay, that's barricaded. What's this? Missing child poster? Age 10, wearing blue jeans. Please, if you see him, use your code word backpack so he will trust you. I really hope that's actually a reference to someone we can meet in the game. That door's also locked. And this food seems to heal me when I eat it. Free first aid. Cool. The art style is very Arcane Studios. Reminds me of Dishonored, actually. A little bit like Fallout 4 in a way as well. My god. Threatening notes. Mr. Sawyer, I've seen you peeking into my windows and putting your ear to my side door. What you think you know isn't even a fraction of what's about to happen. You can stay in Redfall, learn the truth, become one of us, untouchable. Or there's always the alternative. But I don't believe you want to find out what that is. We'll be waiting for you. Oh, okay, so that was from the vampires, I guess. Interesting. Oh, there's a handgun, nice. Bow. Okay, so That's more like it. The legal letter. Oh, her husband's missing. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, she might have actually... Right. 
finished herself off potentially, I don't know. So how do we get down... Okay, there it is. Oh my god, this water's pretty trippy. These vampires must... Ain't no escape for them neither. ...have some mystical powers. So we know in the trunk of a car... There should be a pistol somewhere. Let's crouch under here. Okay, this is pretty trippy. No one's leaving this island. Not with that. Nope. I think we're gonna have to fight back or bite back, as the the trailer says. Ah, oh, this must be the car. Yes, the handgun. Oh no, that must have been his wife then, or another lady who read the letter. Okay, so break glass. How do I hit it? I've also got my loadout. We haven't unlocked skills. Oh my god, this is the map, which is split into different regions. Uh, we're on our current mission. You tried to leave Redfall, but the vampires pushed the ocean back and crashed the boat, blocking your escape. Oh, there we go. Does it work? Yes, it does. Awesome. All right, we need to get out of here before nighttime, I guess. going on with the sun it's already nighttime okay this is pretty tricky Jesus, that ain't no act of god black sun <laughs> is my raven can speak ben okay i wasn't expecting my raven to be like some kind of talking parrot and there is a lot of stuff to loot in this game also when i pick stuff up i actually get money that's an interesting thing okay so it seems like it's worth just looting everything. What the hell are they up to? Wait, that's just one damage? What the hell? Let's try getting closer. Oh, hello. Correct. Now we're hitting them. Okay, headshots do a lot more damage. Correct. And they have medical supplies. Good, good, good. Last one. So I think these heal me fully. Good to know. And they've got tons of ammo. Nice. Oh, I can hear someone there. And there's a chest just here. What's there? Another gun. I hope I can sell these guns. I've got a lot of extra. Oh my god, this guy got wrecked. And there's tons of meds here. How many meds do they think I would need to take out these cultists? I have no ammo, though. Oh, no, I have got ammo now. Good, good, good. What was on this boat that they were hanging out on? Oh, I could have blown that up. Oh, okay. That would have saved me a lot of ammo. <laughs> Whoops. And there's tons of ammo here. And another chest. I need lockpicks. Ah, oh, okay. Can I get on the roof? Is there anything up there? Yes, I can. But there's nothing up here. But I can see there's some more cultists over there in the distance. The world looks pretty big, actually. It's actually nice just to see it all, all these bat swarms as well. It's kind of nuts. Okay, let's jump on these shipping containers here. Oh, I can press C to crouch. Cool, cool, cool. Probably just sneak through these containers to avoid attention. Come on, hurry up. Hey, hey. The sun. Get the damn sun. Oh my god, this guy's tanky. He survived all those hedge. Oh, Jesus. Okay, calm down. Surprise. Hey, Rex. The recoil's nice. The gunplay kind of feels a bit like Fallout 4, actually. Oh, hello. Hey, Rex. I think she had a shotgun. Though the, the movement feels a bit more floaty. Assault rifle ammo. Okay, so that is in the game. That's good to know. I don't know what this red gas stuff is. That looks a bit weird. So I'm going to like just jump over it. Oh, fairy deck key. So, so far we are just over here on the map. Coming a bit further in. We've got to go to the Redfall shore though. Seems to be further up towards the... Is that southwest? I believe. But it's getting darker and darker as we go. I can see some enemies just up ahead. So we'll take these guys out. Oh god, they take a few shots. 
Yeah, wreck me. I think that's another guy over there in the distance. Yep, there he is. Nice. Get wrecked. No real threats right now, but I guess it's the start of the game. Kind of interested to see how much damage they do. There are just shipments of healing equipment around here. I'm excited to get a shotgun, since I keep picking up ammo for other guns. I know that weapon customization is meant to be a big thing in this game. And like collecting different rarities of weapons and, you know, it's very much like looter shooter sort of mechanics in that sense. Okay, what do we have up ahead here? A flare. Flares. Could be a trap. Or some people needing help. Uh, I think everyone needs help in this place. Why do I have a pet crow anyway? Easy. Watch what you're doing. God, what? Calm down. Can I assassinate this guy from behind? So far, you dipshit. So? So they only want the blood if they're still alive. Okay, I thought I'd have like uh, you know be able to like assassinate him with some kind of takedown. Rest but and reload. I guess you don't really need that when a headshot does the job. <laughs> it's a lot louder though. I know you can get silenced pistols, um, which is especially useful. Obviously, on this particular character, when you can literally turn yourself invisible with a stealth cloak. But I haven't played him before, so I'm kind of excited Just to ex farther. experiment with those abilities. Can we use ladders? Yeah. Some guys up here. And down there. There's no way out of this. Take a look at the sun. See if we can climb up. You'll give us the blood again. Let's go. Let's grab someone. Let's go rush. This is more like dishonored gameplay where you can like sneak around and stuff. I think that guy with the megaphone probably alerts people when when he hears things nearby. Okay, get on the roof. Here we go. Okay, follow the blood. There's a warning letter. Do not listen. Do not listen. It's all lies. Nothing but lies. He spews filth. Do not listen. Oh, a flare gun. Okay. And some ammo. So we can either climb up here, or there's another way around here. Oh, I can see a dude right there. Hello? Can I shoot through the glass? They're looking at a door. Can I get inside? We aren't gonna hurt you. This window is open. We don't wanna hurt you, but we might. <laughs> what is going on in there? I'll climb up here. Let's jump in through the roof, I guess. Get wrecked. How did you know I was up here? Well, can I take damage? No, we're good. Nice. That was pretty easy. Oh, there's someone looking around for me outside, though. That's not good. Knock, knock. Hey! You alright in there? Yes. Hello? We're in here. Are you... Are the cultists still around? I can't open this door until they're gone. Oh, dead. Dead would be better. They cut the power on us. We've got wounded in here. And they got a blood sucker in the basement. They all answer to it. Can you help us out? You want me to kill a vampire for you? Oh dear. This looks like... Oh, we're at a fire station. That's the only place that would have a fireman pole, right? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> I was not expecting that, to be honest. <laughs> Firefighter of the year. In recognition of your courage. Well done, Mr. Firefighter. Can't see any foot feet over there. Which is probably a good thing. What's in here? Who's this guy? Looks like uh, some kind of demon overlord. He's keeping an eye on us. The toilets. Oh, one sec. Here's a shotgun. 
Find a weapon with a stake. Oh, so we can deal with the vampire, I guess. Can hardly see it in this light, but it has a stake attached to it, I believe. Okay, let's head down into the basement. Just follow the bodies, pretty much. Vampire is feeding. Oh, mate, I can see the shadow. Shoot him in the back of the head. Another shotgun. Nice. Oh my god, that did nothing. Oh, oh god, oh god. Ah! Okay, chill, chill, chill. Oh my, okay, if you hit them just before they attack, big damage. Oh! Okay, that was bad. Let's try again. Dude, where the hell? He just disappeared. Okay, it's giving me time to reload at least. He definitely knows where I am. Oh my god, that did half a health. Goodness me. Stake. Oh, sick. Okay. They pop up, we put them down. Yeah, that was cool. Level up. Nice. I wonder if we level up faster. You've unlocked Japen's, Jacob's first hero ability, the Raven. Hold Z to have your Raven mark nearby threats. And we can spend skill points to level it up. So if I go to my skills, I've unlocked the Raven ability. And there's like a whole skill tree for each of these different skills and ultimate. As well as bandoliers, extra storage for handgun, shotgun ammo. Pretty bog standard. Carry more lockpicks. Extra headshot damage, that's pretty good. Requires level 4. Raven recharges faster, increase Raven's scan radius while flying, and enemies stay marked longer. Increase Raven's scan radius? Isn't that like the same thing? The Raven can also destroy bun vulnerable vampires. That's pretty good because you can't do that from range otherwise. So I'm going to get this skill for now. Alright, we're meant to actually turn on the power, but I forgot to do that. Yo, I got distracted. More like it. Now we can go and tell the survivor that everything's uh, okay. Killed everyone. Are the cultists gone? It's safe to come out now. We got them all. It's safe. Oh, who's this? It's one hot looking priest. Gun club and she's pregnant. That's probably the most American t-shirt I've ever seen in my life. And I guess these are the, the survivors of the fire department. Which I guess kind of makes sense as a place to hold up. They have their own showers and everything, right? So... They're just turning into a little survivor headquarters. And I guess this is going to be our little base of operations now. Drop a like on the video, by the way, guys, if you're enjoying it so far. Personally, I think it's pretty decent. Um, this is really my first impressions playing the game. I've only had, like, an hour on it before jumping in to play myself, so... I have very limited experience on, uh, you know, I'm not going to give you my full review just from this small playthrough. But um, I'm excited for this game because it has vampires and because it's from Arcane Studios. So I'm expecting good level design and creativity. See who's running this outfit. Time to meet the locals. Time to meet the locals. I think this is a pre-order weapon that I've unlocked as well. I've also unlocked a pre-order weapon, a level 2 legendary weapon. Dude, what is that? That looks nuts. Killing an enemy with this weapon grants its 20% increased damage for 8 seconds. Magazine holds 2 extra rounds and it has 50% more accuracy. I can also customize these weapons with different skins. Blue or red. So I have different outfits my character can wear. Eyes in the dark outfit. He looks like Snake from Metal Gear Solid now. The standard outfit definitely looks the coolest. Right, so now we need to go and talk to the people we just helped. Hello there. Mr. Boyer, am I right? I'm glad you're here. You'd be the only one. I don't want to think about what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I speak for everyone when I say thank you. My name is Terence Hunt. I'm a doctor. Used to work at Redfall Regional. I'm taking care of everyone here. Sick, injured, and everything in between. If you need medical supplies, come to me. But only take as much as you need. I'm gonna there take everything. who need help just as much as you. It's mine now. We could have died. I have to pay for this. I'm not paying for that. You've eaten far too many medical supplies, my friend. Reverend Lost and Found. Hello. Jacob, right? Well, 
I'm glad you're on our side. Huh. Good. My name is Reverend Diva. Nice to meet you. Sorry it couldn't be under better circumstances. I do the organizing around here. Lost and found. Okay, so you can buy lockpicks and rewire kits in here. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you scared the crap out of me. Jacob, huh? What's with the eye? Don't the ask. Eye. Well, we owe you one. I'm Anna. And this is my husband, Joe. You ran into one of those creeps, yeah? Only way to kill him is with a stake to the heart. Makes him pop like a firework. Those loonies, you can take out with a regular gun, though. And we got plenty of those. This stake's free, but you gotta earn the guns out of my stash. Sorry. She's oh. not sorry. <laughs> I ain't sorry. Anyway, nice to meet you. Need anything? I got... Say goodbye, Joe. Goodbye, goodbye Joe. <laughs> goodbye, Joe. <laughs> Causeway. Improved shotgun. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. That's all my money, but I can buy a sniper? Yes. I can salvage my old stuff. What do I get for that? Oh, I get 200 gold. Ah, let's salvage all this stuff we don't need then. I don't need this flare gun. All right, now I got a sniper rifle. I'm going to go outside and try this bad boy out. Four young people torn to shreds. Apparently one was drained of their blood. So the signs were there if you knew what you were looking for. So a lot of these little lore bits I'm finding kind of just seem to be sort of developing the story on kind of and world space very ever so slightly. And what's upstairs? Mission briefing room. Okay, so this is where we progress the story. Two birds with one stone. Accept mission. Don't know how all this started. Don't care. <laughs> when we got here, things were already a hair shy of Halloween. Dead empty streets. Secret fires. Things creeping in the windows. Made contact on the second day. I got hit hard and drug off. Lights out. Woke up tasting blood with this freak-ass bird in my grill. I'd just as soon be in hell with my back broke. But it ain't up to me. I can't go back to Bellwether. No one's coming to help these civilians. A few dozen of us tried getting off the island on that ferry. But damn bloodsuckers killed the sun and pushed back the ocean. Something out of the Bible. Supposed to be a few places we can check for supplies. Ain't nothing left to do but cut out and grab some gear. Maybe save some idiots in the process. I'm done talking. Let's go. My character looks badass. He looks like Odin. Okay, we've got to go and collect some supplies from the fire station. Now those sort of uh, cinematic scenes are different depending on which starting character you actually choose. Okay, so this is the way out. I see. My dude's not guarding the door anymore. Whoa. What? Yeah. That was Bellwether. Searching those choppers could be the fastest way to find supplies. Your children crying out for me. I need you here. And you need me to be well. I have brought you down from the sky. I am the Hollow Man. The Hollow Man. Hollow Man? Shit. If he's trying to scare me, it'll take more than that. Ha! Oh, dude, look how rapidly it's coming over. Does it know where I Look! <laughs> Jesus! Jesus. Okay, okay, it's down, it's down. Let's go get him. How do I hit him? Get wrecked, son. I don't think we have long to actually take them out there. Bloodsuckers are gone. For now. This reminds me of Fallout 76 when you first sort of go out into the world. It's massive. Look. Oh, that was my one sniper shot. You joking. If only I'd know. At least we used it on a vampire, I guess. Oh, what's that? There's some electricity box. I'm not actually going to shoot that this time. Last time I did that, it was a mistake. Jesus Christ. What the hell? They've got some weird thing going on. There's something over there. These guys are really strong. 
goodness me. Whoa, why are they leaking so much blood? Oh my god, why am I losing health right now? Jesus. I need to back off a bit here. Quickly heal myself. Get wrecked. And you. Goodness me, okay. Whoa, what was that? Was that his gun? Oh, there's some apples in here. That's, that's useful. A coffee grinder, of course. And I'll take all your stuff, thank you very much. That was a fun little skirmish. I wasn't expecting there to be so many people. Did I get any... I didn't get any sniper ammo though, did I? Look how cool this sniper looks as well. Ooh, there is a new handgun in there. As well. I like that each weapon has a different appearance to it. That's pretty cool. If I look on the map... So I'm going to go over to this helicopter here. It already looks like it's night time as well. This car boot seems to be left open. I'm going to come inside this house and see if we can find anything inside it. <sighs> Whoa, hello. I can use my my bird. I should probably actually use that. Go on, fly over. Your cheap bird brain. Oh, my bad, there's a vampire in here and I just shot my gun. Oh, it's outside. It's right here. Yes. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's right there. How did I miss it? Get wrecked, son. Stop me if you can. <laughs> Stop me if you can. Get wrecked, son. That vampire is a lot weaker than the other ones we met. Or maybe my shotgun was just a lot more powerful. I don't know. I can lockpick this door. There must be another way. I'm not going to waste a lockpick. I'm a Khajiit. By the way, I've got the graphics on medium. That's where those, uh, that tree loaded in really weirdly there. Should probably turn up the graphics, but I want to stream this and like just test it out. End of the world therapy four, day 10. Morning, still trying to keep my notes in case I meet Dr. Sharda again. Chances seem slim. Broke out on my own front window to make it look like the place was looted. That didn't bring me any joy. I'll make sure to bring it up at the next session. Okay, so he's like some kind of psychiatrist. Got some more ammo here. Shh. I know you're here, but back. Give yourself to me. Oh, oh. Okay, yeah, yeah. Recover. Jesus, how did he not spot me? Oh! oh my god. Jesus oh, Christ. You can Get wrecked, you vampire scum. I have no shotgun ammo. Up, up. We put them down. What I tell you to do. I really need some shotgun ammo. You better have some shotgun ammo in your house, bro. End of the world therapy too. Definitely world ending. But you have to see the humor in the bloodsuckers overrunning the world. On a metaphorical level, if anything. Dr. Sharda would probably ask how that made me feel. And my honest answer would be unsurprised and terrified out of my mind. Which is why I tucked between the bed and the wall. <laughs> Oh, one sec. Can I take binoculars? Oh, we can't use them. They're just like a lootable item, I guess. I like how he has the pool table up against the wall here, though. I guess I would, too. Check out the upstairs, then. Oh, so a UV light. That's going to be useful if we get attacked. Therapy free. Day seven. It's strangely comforting knowing that everything you thought about life was actually true. No one really likes each other. They're more happy to throw someone else to the wolves. And vampires? Still processing that. But I'd be lying if I said I was completely surprised. Dr. Charlotte says I'm too cynical. <laughs> okay. Oh, steak launcher ammo. Dude, that's going to be insanely useful when we find that. We can shoot people, vampires, with our sniper rifle. I, I know you can get a silenced one. Ah, do I open the safe with my lockpick? I think so. I think we use our lockpick on this. Oh my god, that's an assault rifle. That's what I can use against the vampire scum. I have a lot of assault rifle ammo too. Anything else in here? Another end of the world five, day 11. Yeah, I'm over this. Thinking the ship would right itself, but knowing all along that it wouldn't. Optimism is the enemy. Time to go. Probably too late, but still time to go. Not a lot to loot in there. So this is the light, the UV light. I guess we can freeze vampires with this. If I can use it correctly. But for now... I can hear some screams in the distance. Gotta go down here to this helicopter crash. 
I'm liking that I'm getting distracted by looting the things in the world. I'm not going to use my owl, my crow over there. Let's use it in this direction, see if I find Show anything. Me something good. There's nothing there, so we should be fine. Jeez. Oh, can I get on that, that like, uh, quad bike? Yo, I didn't know they had driving in this game. Oh, no, you can't. It's just, like, an explosive, essentially. So many houses. Let's go and check out this little zone here. It's pretty dark now. I don't know if vampires get more powerful or how that works. There's a board game. Oh, oh my god, what is that? Oh, that's terrifying. It's more terrifying than any of the vampires you've seen. Yo, what is that? I take this guy out from here. Oh, that didn't kill him. That took him out. Okay. That took him out, though. 671 crit? Oh, so you can crit. That's interesting. There's a turret up there, though, so I've got to be careful. There's an enemy over there looking for me now. We want to sneak around so we get... Oh, Jesus. Get wrecked. She didn't seem to know where I was, which is nice. This place ain't killed me yet. Hey, listen. We could use your help getting some safe houses set up while you're out there. Oh. The more places folks have to lay low, the better. It'll also give us a foothold to take back our neighborhoods from these monsters and their goddamn cults. My friends already laid the groundwork in a few places, but as you can imagine, they're not really safe yet. If you spot one, just get the power going and give us a shout on the radio. Dude, it's pitch black. I can see that one of the helicopters is over there, though. I assume this game has, like, a pretty consistent day-night cycle. Ooh, okay. This is the turret. Jesus. They have a lot of health. <laughs> okay, this works. Why are there two turrets there next to each other? Oh, is that another sniper? Oh my god, it's a better sniper. There's two snipers here. Okay, so it staggers enemies and does more damage. I mean, that's going to be the obvious choice there. This pistol is also better because it does more damage. So let's... Oh, is that a silence pistol we found? Oh, we're going to get kitted, boys. Let's grab this food. And there's a telescope where we can see the helicopter. So clearly someone's already been sent out there. Let's see if I send out the birdie attack bird i can't see any enemies there's a lot of green fog i mean red fog i don't know why i said that was green what's wrong with me and there's a cave going into the darkness i guess i have to go down why is this place completely unflooded anyway it's a lake right yeah let's run into this cave hopefully we'll meet nosferatu or dracula Water or something being gone opened up some places that shouldn't be oh so the vampires we're hiding here all along. Oh, watch this. I'm gonna get mad damage. That was nothing. Why went through her legs? Okay, she's not even doing anything. She's just chilling. Get wrecked. Oh, we need to stake her. I want to try out the assault rifle. She seemed to get stuck on the corner Last or something. One's down and dusty. And I have no ammo. And we're going into what must be a vampire cave. So here we go. Wish me luck. What is that? Come on, detect. Make yourself useful. There's no enemies here. Oh, there's a shotgun. Nice. I need to deconstruct some of these weapons. We have a... Just heard a vampire growling. What's that over there? Go, go. See what that is. Jeez, there's a bloody vampire right there. I couldn't even see it. Get wrecked. And again. Okay, I'm getting the assault rifle. Let's test this out. Oh! Okay, you do have to be accurate with this. Get hit. I don't think it detected me, it's so dark in here. There's a lot of this red fog stuff, I'm trying to avoid it. I don't know if I can actually... Can I run through it? Yellow. 
seems to be fine. Let's reload this silence weapon. It doesn't seem to do much damage. I think I need to get a lot closer. Oh, the, oh there's a gas mask. No, it just gives me money. I thought I'd be able to go in and get that green blue skull. Sorry. I don't know why everything's green in my head. Yeah, what's this? There's a dude up there. And there's some explosives. Make yourself useful. Let's use that to shock them. Oh, this is a lot slower firing. They definitely know I'm here. Oh, jeez, what's that? What's that? Is that a Molotov? Oh, no, it's a smoke grenade thing. Last one. Okay. Is there anyone else here? Let's check. Show me something good. Ooh, there's a few enemies hiding, are there? Okay, let's quickly get back here. And snipe this guy over here. Dude, what? How did how did that not kill him? What? Okay, that definitely killed him. Nice. Take this guy. The recoil is mad, but it does a lot of damage. They have no idea where I am. <laughs> oh my god. My stealth is oh, sneak 100, guys. Ah, cultist bag. I want to check out this helicopter site. Not, I don't think I'm a fan of the silence pistol. Just seemed, it felt very lackluster, but it did feel quiet, that was for sure. But then I used the sniper and the assault rifle and they still didn't know where I was. Ooh, we got a new assault rifle there. Automatic assault rifle, 35 damage. What is that? A grave lock. Auntie? Auntie, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you got dragged down into this. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. Go and scout Make ahead. Yourself useful. Nothing there. Grave locks are scattered around Redfall in hidden caches and hard to reach places. These artifacts contain locks of hair taken from the mysterious figure connected to the vampire threat in Redfall. Oh, so this is like how you discover the main story. Collect them to hear echoes of her story and earn bonuses to psychic residue regeneration. Okay, so everyone here is dead. Hey, thing working? This is Sharon. I hear ya. We're coming up on the second chopper now, no sign of life. Still looking for those supply crates they dumped. I, I don't think we should be on these radios too much. Why? What if they're listening? What if they sent more soldiers? You know who's listening? The Hollow Man. He served these choppers up to us on a platter. So just make sure you get those goddamn supply crates. Some of those cultists are after the supply cache. Could cut them off. Or head straight for the supplies. Still that second chopper too. Ooh, hack it. Rewire. Let's go ahead and hack it in then. Ah, uh, another gun that's... Oh, actually it's better than my handgun. <laughs> you should probably swap that. I'm gonna salvage all this crap I don't need. Okay, we got this nice gun. It's got like the Call of Duty... So now, on the map, we have got to the chopper crash site, and we've got to go over here and get this supply crate. It's actually back the way I came, interestingly. It's over there. It's really close to me. I'm gonna send my bird over here, see if we can spy on. Ha! I think we're safe. That's the supply crate right there. Can't hit anyone. I think we're alone. There's some bellwether supplies. I'll let the folks back at the fire station know there's supplies here. Better go check out that second chopper first, though. Got full ammo now. Okay, so the second chopper is all the way over here. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Jesus. She's right there. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Die. Steak. Get steak. 
Jesus, they're right... How was I meant to know they were right next to me? Let's go ahead and heal myself. Heal, 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 heal. Oh my god, it doesn't heal enough. Is this useful? No. Oh my god, this thing hits like a trap. Get wrecked. I have two scope weapons and we've just absolutely got craps on. They just spawned all the way around me, I think. Damn. Okay, so now we've got to go to the other helicopter crash site, which is on the other side of this lake. Goodness me. That was intense. Looks like some kind of safe house. Good place to hunker down and stock up after we secure it. Oh, this place. Okay. We can have a go at securing this. We are literally running past it. Mate, that was intense. There's no one around, though. Open this door. I can see wires leading out the window, so I assume if I power on the electricity, oh, shit. Oh, my god. oh my god! Goodness me! Oh my god! There's another one. Ah! Ah! Jesus Christ! My god, there's even more cultists outside! Can I heal myself? Where the hell is it? There it is! Goodness me, kill it! Okay, I'm going through tons of healing right now. Ooh! Dude, you just tanked that headshot like it was nothing. I need to increase my crit shots. Oh my god, where did his body go? It looked like it just evaporated into midair. Oh, dude. Like, they, like I want to play stealthy, but they keep spawning enemies on top of me. Oh my goodness. It's just like, hey, fight for your life. Like, I think I might play another character as my main character, because if they spawn enemies on top of me like that, like, I can't play around that. It's, it's really intense. Okay, can I go in this safe house now? Is it actually safe, or do I have to kill a demon? This is anything but safe. Anyone there? Congratulations. You've unlocked the safe house. You can now fast travel to the safe house on the map. Oh, that's great for the future missions we'll be doing. If safe house is, is up there, and running. Please pick up. Safe house missions view. Ah, oh, okay, cool. Right, we can go back out now. Okay, so we have to go up this pathway to the mission itself. I'm really enjoying exploring the open world so far. Hello, who are these people? You're dead now? You're dead now? I think something heard that that wasn't human. Let's have a look. What do you have? Assault rifle ammo? Yeah. Let's go up the hill here then and head towards this helicopter crash. Which I think was on the mountainside somewhere. Oh my god, it's all the way up there? Oh my god, 210 damage. Let's go. It doesn't know where I am. <laughs> go up there and just check everything out. That vampire dude on the radio is quite creepy. You. Jesus, how did my bird not detect you? And I have, I cannot hit you to save my life. There we go. How did it not see him? I question my bird's usefulness on this character. I want to unlock something else so I can see how good that is. It's a sniper. Ow, okay, you hurt. Snipe this, buddy. Oh. There we go. You're right. I'm going to go ahead and heal up here. Where does this look? Into the fog. The weather seems very dynamic in this game. It keeps changing. Like, it wasn't foggy earlier at all. 
Is this the uh, travel route that we read about the sheriff's note where those people got murdered? Trail's rough. I seem worse. Hello there. Get wrecked. Whoa, 1,000 damage on this. Get wrecked, son. And you. It's weird. I don't know. If you crit, sometimes you crit for way more than normal. Okay, let's grab this stuff. I don't know if there's any reason why I'd want to check over here. Oh, yes, there was. I appreciate that. This is the arcane I know. Hiding some cool stuff. The grave lock. There was more of us. Mama, daddy, brothers and sisters. All Let's do some recon. Dead. Just me. Just me and Auntie. Just her and her aunt were left. Okay, so I wonder if it's an ongoing pickup. Like if you find, you know another one in any location whether it's this location or another location it always tells you the next part of the story i think that's the only way it would make sense you know otherwise it'd be quite confusing yeah this is definitely the hiking trail trust okay and here another cultist but i can't see it oh that's not what i wanted to do i wanted to send my bird out to see if i could actually make some use out of it you worm bucket Okay, there we go. That's good. Get wrecked. They don't even know I'm here. Oh, did he did he fill that? Or did it go into the rock next to him? Seems kind of pointless having a silent sniper rifle right now. Let's we'll send it on to the crash site, it looks like. Yeah, here's another one. Get wrecked. Last one. What do you mean? Come a long way up here. Man, that helicopter really crashed. Ah, here's some first aid. What is that? A UV-1028 Medusa? It creates ultraviolet rays which petrify enemies, turning them to stone. Pretty sick. We got two of those. And tons of ammo. Jeez, I thought that guy's head just moved there. There's the second chopper. Where? Is there anyone else there? Though? Let's have a look. Go, buddy. Let's do some recon. Looks like it's These just operators me. Operators must have had different orders from my unit. Why are they throwing so many bodies at this? It's bigger than I thought. Ooh, epic pistol! Headshots with this weapon deal an additional fifty percent bonus damage. Bellwater Profile Addison Pizza. Ha, <laughs> my dude looks evil. Mission Brief. Board Chairman of Avian Therapeutics. Secure and destroy all hard assets outlined in subsection 4C at mission site. Collect intelligence on the location and state of VIPs and submit it to HQ. Neutralize any hostiles or witnesses. So they're trying to do a big cover up of what happened here. Avian VIPs. Oh, and we've got a list. Peter Addison is one of the people. Sent to burn evidence on an island for the vampires. I guess that ain't a coincidence. Better get this intel back to base. Level up again, nice. Oh, we've unlocked the cloak ability, guys. Activate Jacob's stolen bellwether cloak to hide from enemies. And it's actually daytime now, so it does have a day-night cycle completely. Oh wait, there's a cave down here. So I can fast travel back to the fire station, but I don't think I will yet. Go on, bird. I just saw a vampire up there. Okay, it triggered that one. Ghosting out. Okay, so I'm invisible. I can sprint like this, right? That's cool. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, they can see me now. Let's kill it. Yeah, Rex, I'm... All right, so now let's fast travel back to the fire station. Okay, so now we have a selection of three different missions with three different paths that we can choose. 
And the picture we found got added to the board. I'll add a link to the live stream where we're going to play a different character in the description below. You can come there and ask me anything, including my thoughts on the game. So I'll see you guys there, but do drop a like on the video before you go. And let me know if you want to see another solo episode like this, because I really enjoyed playing for it. I've literally played two hours at this point, so I really can't tell you my full review on the game. But hopefully after five hours of playing on live stream, I'll have more of an idea. So come chat to me there. I'll see you soon.